Hello, it is I, TNT the Insane. And, uh, okay, yeah, Maxwell is hungry. Yeah, it's, it's, um, I might have just come down here, but, uh, I really can't survive down there. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're popping back up. Sorry about that. Um, but that is a place that is around. Uh, did I make a base? I don't think I made, made a base. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's around, and. Yeah, that that's uh, going to be a possible worry for my future. Don't worry, we will explore that if I live that long. Um, we'll pop down and we'll see if they have any uh, eh, surprises for me. Surprise death. Um, <coughs> got a few uh, good ideas. Uh, oh wait, I did make a base, didn't I? Um, I got a few good ideas, like to cut down a few more things. Um, and I'm gonna... Where, where did I make that base? It's so difficult to see on these things sometimes that, uh, it's just... I don't know, it's, it's difficult to see on the map, especially because my scroll wheel is broken. So I can't lean in, or lean in? I can't move in and have a look to see what's there. Is it here? I think it was around here, wasn't it? Somewhere near the ocean. Beautiful, here we go. So it is that point, right in the middle, right there, that uh, that is has stuff in it. Um, in it. I, I love the gnome. Religious artifact, I'm going to drop it here. It's going to keep me company. The box thing, uh, what's it say? This may control the polarity of the whole universe. Alrighty then, drop this here then. Um, that looks mysterious. But I, I am currently very hungry, so I'm going to burn a little grass. Not much, but... Uh, and cook a few things. Uh, so I'm gonna eat that and cook some of these because I'm I need to get my food up. I need to keep on living and surviving and all that. You know the things you're meant to do. Um, so yeah, uh, it's hey look at that food fill up. Um, what you've got to do, what you've got to make sure you do, is maintain the area that you have dug up. Uh, I haven't been planting things, and I should. Uh, right now, just stick down a few things. You know, it's it's evergreen saplings. Uh, do I have anything else? No, I don't believe so. Twigs, um, rope. Rope burns really well, uh, but it's a bit... Okay, I'm going to cut down some more trees. It's, it's a bit like... <clears throat> when uh, dealing with it. Um, because it's a lot of grass you, you carve up. Uh, to burn rope. Basically, planks and rope. They burn for, like, the entire night. But they also have a bad habit of, um, chewing through your resources. Like, if I use my rope up now, I might not have enough to do certain things. Like, uh, no, no, no. I'm gonna cut down this one. Might not have enough to, to do certain things. Like, uh, maybe get a, a log suit, a way of protecting myself. Here we go. Also, these stumps that are lying around, you can actually, um, you can do something cool with them. You can dig them up so you get an extra log, so they don't just, le you know, stick around, leaving scut. Oh my god, no! What are you? Um... Ah! What are you? What are you? What are you? What are you? Okay, I'm gonna stick uh, one rope on the fire. And... Oh my god, no! What? What is... What? No, ho, go away. Um, tools. No, I, I want survival. Uh, stick. Where's, where's, where's the, where's the goddamn spear? Where's the spear? Fight. Okay. What do I need for the? Oh, oh god. Um, spear, sticks. Uh, oh, I can't. I can't. I just can't. This is dangerous. They're very fast. Uh, no, oh god, they're very fast. Okay. Um, I know it's dark. I wish it wasn't. Wish, wish it wasn't dark. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Um, just so this is it. This is the game. This is what happens. You. Yes, I know it's dark. Okay, I'm gonna have to run. This this base is right now just over overwhelmed. I can't do a single thing. Um, no. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. Okay, if if this light goes out, I'm screwed. I can't. I, I, okay, a bit, a bit of fire, a bit of fire. Uh, that was such a risky thing to try and pull off. Um, 
Shut up, Maxwell. You know Maxwell. You're Wilson. Shut up, everyone. Oh god. Oh god. What? Oh, the the roaming beasts of hell. Why are you here? I told you. I told you they want to kill me. I can't even make anything. I can't make something to run away because if I stop, they will pounce on me. And I'm dead. Wow. Wow. Okay. Retry. I'm just gonna. Re that was that was just like swooping in suddenly. Overwhelming death with no no way of avoiding it. Yeah. I I told myself I'm not going to die this episode. I'm not going to die. I'm going to be survive. I'm going to be, you know, sensible and smart, but that was just so many bat. I don't even know what those were. Were those bats? Those were giant evil creatures, whatever they were. And, and good lord, I uh, Wow. Oh, I hate you, you stupid man. So yeah, starting over. Starting new again. This game is hard. I forgot how hard this game could be. Um Okay, let's let's start up. Uh what do we need? We need an X. Uh, build an X. We can get some... Oh my... Oh god. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really sorry. This is just completely and utterly abysmal. <laughs> it's just like, I'm gonna do well today. I can't explore there because it's dangerous, so I won't explore there. I'm gonna go back to where I was safe a few moments ago, and I'm gonna sleep the night, and holy testicles did the bats descend upon me with no warning. I just, I can't, I can't believe it. I'm, I'm tempted, to, like, if I do a next episode and I die again, I'm half tempted to just stop the series because it'd be less embarrassing to just go, I admit it, it defeated me, bye. Um, like, maybe I should try someone else, try the fire starter. The fire starter might have, um, like, she, uh, she might be more, uh, akin to surviving the night because she gets a lighter she can run around and start fires herself uh pond like she, she can start fires herself so that means that she won't be trapped in the dark like that but it's still how many were there and that was my base that was what i used my gold on that was where i had everything set up and then just death descends upon me okay no more obsession about what happened uh, that keeps happening. I keep going. Oh, and this is what happened. This is uh, this is where I fell. This is the issues. This is how I died. But um, no, no. Let's uh, let's try and find some positive things, like the graveyard up there. Oh, for goodness' sake. Uh, okay, there's a skeleton. He has a torch and um, a not very well maintained torch, but several several ropes. That's good. Uh. Can I make a shovel yet? No, because you you can dig up these graves with the shovel. Uh, not the best idea. Sometimes things that don't like you pop out. Uh, but um, it's still there's lots of useful things in graves, even in the real world. Many useful things of uh, unrelenting. Oh, oh, touchstone. This will mean this means that if I die, I will come back to life. I will revive there. I have one death in this world. One measly, pitiful death. And then I'm back to how it is usually. Okay, so this is a good area to, to be in from the look of it. It's between uh, a place that's heavily rock orientated, some places with food, and some places with um, uh, trees. So I can maintain my life here. Uh, it's it's pretty good. It's uh, it could be worse. It could be better. It could be much worse. Actually, there's nothing trying tempting to murder me just yet. Um, I don't see any moles around, which is probably good because they would be eating all of my resources at this moment. Uh, but I might be able to start off the first day with a campfire to begin with. I'm looking around, you, you're probably going, why are you moving around so much? Well, I'm looking around because I'm seeing if there's anywhere with beefalo. I know that would be very lucky, like, to just 
manage to land a beefalo farm or like the the place would pick up their dung at the very least so early in the game but I managed it last time just with random um, random chance random chance which I believe is a uh, what you would call it <laughs> villain um, no random task that's it and it's uh, d d d d d the James Bond rip off that isn't a rip off but it's a, the homage um, Austin Powers that's it Austin Powers I always call him Johnny English, but that's the other Doctor uh, Doctor Who, the other um, oh James Bond ripoff. Austin, they do enjoy ripping off James Bond, don't they? Okay, so there's glaciers here. Um, I've also been advised by some very nice people who have been admiring my work, and by admiring, going, oh God, what's he doing? But yeah, I've been advised that if I see another Maxwell door, jump straight into it. Don't even think about it. Go straight in, because it'll give me an another life, another chance. You know, I found it actually really on in that previous playthrough. I could have jumped in, and it would have been perfectly fine, because I would have started in a new air. Oh, it's a tall bird. Oh, tall bird nests. Um, tall birds are violent. Sorry, uh, I went silent there, because I, I just saw something black and horrible, and I didn't want to go near it. But uh, tall birds are violent. They also have eggs. Now you can cook the eggs, or you can hatch the eggs, and they'll become your own personal little, um, let's say, servant. Uh, so yeah, that's a... Uh, oh, it's a nice place around here, actually. Not too bad, not too bad. Uh, and... I think... There's lots of flint. Tons of flint. And there's even a glacier back there, and glaciers can be used for... Um, it's, it was the melted puddle. The, the ice there can be used for certain things down the road, you know? Uh, won't be incredibly useful just now, I believe, unless I get really hot in summer, at which point I think I, uh, I... You can get hot in this game. You can get hot, you can get cold, you can get wet, you can get um, probably something else that I can't even think of at the moment. You, you, you can get molested by bats. That was such a proud moment for me, wasn't it? Uh, okay, make, make the damn thing. Um, make it now. Wonderful. Uh, I'm just going to stay here, because this looks like a love heart. And uh, I like it having... With love hearts. Love hearts are cool. Also, I can try and use this berry bush to farm. And berry bushes are useful uh, to farm. I'm going to cook a carrot. Though uh, I could, I suppose... Not just cook it, but like... Um, use it to bait animals. You can use them to bait animals. Yay! <laughs> Starting over and over again kind of drains it your your own sanity, not just the sanity of your characters. Come on, let's build a science machine. Uh, what have we got? We can make rope and nothing else at the moment. Um, no advanced lights. Can't even make a shovel because I don't have enough twigs. Um... Okay, let's uh, let's make some rope because I ha already have a pile of rope, and I you know it'll come useful at some point because now I can make rope in otherwise. Um, okay, what do I need? What do I, I just need to survive? Uh, okay, first things first, I need better protection, so I'm going to make a log suit. Um, I'm not sure where that falls under, but I'm gonna. It was in a, would it be survival? Uh, because there's definitely... Do you know the grass suits that uh, I uh, managed to find? The, um, the grass suits you could uh, you could make. There we go, grass suit. Now, log suit is much more sturdy and um, keeps you alive for quite a bit longer. I'm sorry for making all the ears. Um, uh, uh, it's something I've never really been able to handle. Um, see, again? Again I do it. Stupid brain. Okay, let's let's make a log suit and wear it, and that'll make me much sturdier, much stronger. Um, I use some of my logs there. I, did I use all of my logs? Oh, good God, I use all my logs. I'm going to have to cut down some trees. If you cut down enough trees, you get in trouble, so let's hope that I don't get in trouble. Uh, so chop down a couple trees, plant a couple of useful trees around here if the fire if things one of the dangers that you can get 
of having the exposed fire for people going, well, why don't he, doesn't he just make an exposed fire all the time? Exposed fires that don't have the rocks around them can accidentally set everything on fire. Uh, so, if you put too much fuel in them to keep them going, say at the beginning of the night, you don't want to attend the fire day in, day out, all the time. Um, if you try that, then... <laughs> tall bird! But if you try that, then... <laughs> uh, sometimes results in everything being set on fire. I'm going to keep the tall bird there, because it might be useful to take their... Oh god, that's them spotting me! No! You bugger! Stay away! I wonder if you'll leave me alone. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm... Okay, it's just out of... Just out of range there. Uh, thankfully. Um, I can make another science machine! Yay! I need alchemy engines, though, really. Science machines are good for the beginning, but... Not so good when things progress. Hmm... I might have made my... My base in a bad area. Oh uh, dear. I'm kind of secluded up there and I got trees, but there's a bird nest over there. Then again, I keep going, bad area, but I've not ever, ever come across a good area. Every single place of this um, land is infected with some kind of horrible disease or monsters or enemies, something that wishes to remove your scalp from the rest of your body with very violent force um, and possibly the rest of you as well the hunger for your blood and your flesh and generally every bodily function that you go through when seeing those monsters for the first time they hunger for all of it and that's disgusting um, if, if I die during this playthrough I might just come back find a forest and set everything on fire I might just be tempted to go you know what screw the rules Everything dies because I say so. Uh, it's very tempting to do that sometimes. Lots of rocks, not much food in this area. Biomes need to pick a sapling. I haven't done enough picking of saplings. Um, ooh, there's a bunny. Bunnies are useful. Bunnies you can farm. Um, there's only one though, and that makes it difficult. Farm bunnies. Oh, it's a mini glacier. Come on. Very isolated glacier. Can I use this? Ooh. I'm guessing that ice is going to melt. Oh, I can... Uh, I'm not going to try and cook ice. I'm not an idiot. But isolated glacier. Interesting. Um, very, very secluded out of the way. Where is... My, like, my base is up there. I get... Oh, I have such difficulty spotting it. My base is my base is just up there, so that really means I've driven myself out of the way again. So I'm gonna have to move around, but it's better to have two bases than none at all. Because uh, uh, there's some rocks and stuff, but there's not many lasting resources. Lots of gold. I don't think I've ever seen so many gold rocks here. You can tell by the little um, little fractures around there. Uh, so I'm not quite sure how to handle this. Do I just keep on walking? I'm gonna try and stick to slightly more... I'm, g I'm gonna have to make a freeform fire now. I'm going gonna do it because basically I'm, I'm moving around. Whoa! God damn it! Uh, did I... Okay. Oh, why do I always find threats? <clears throat> right, so I'm gonna... Did I... Did I, can I make a spear? I can't make a spear. Right, okay. I'm gonna... I can't make a torch. Oh, why do I hate myself? Uh, gonna make a run for it. Gonna head up to... Uh, there. I've, I wish I could set a waypoint on the marker so I knew where I was heading. I've got a torch uh, that is useful. Here we go. Tall bird. Um, not quite. Ah, I made it. Okay, it's not that bad a walk. It's not that bad a walk. It's still a bad walk, but it's not that bad a walk. Now I'm going to make a uh, spear as soon as I possibly can. Why? Because I don't want to die, and I need to make spears on the run. Um, I need more twigs. I need more freaking twigs. Okay. There's nowhere in the vicinity, and... Is there? 
nowhere in the vicinity and I don't want to leave very far from my camp. I have that fire thing, the torch, but no, I'm not fancying my chances out there right now. Um, I have so little food as well. I have berries. That's uh, slightly filling my stomach there. Um, slightly. If I stayed near the fire with that in my pockets, it would just melt down to water. Which isn't very good, unfortunately. Um, I'm gonna wait until the very last second to throw some fuel on. And... Darkness incoming in three, two, probably now. Where are you? Okay, let's just add some fuel. Uh, that's that's probably more than enough. I just don't want to be caught unprepared. Be prepared, as the Boy Scouts always said, and yet they never saw it coming. Um, let's see. Board. I'm gonna make some cut stone and some boards, just because it's always good to be able to make those on the fly. Structures. Sign. You need. Yeah. Sign. This is where I died. That's that's what my sign's gonna read. Science. Uh, electrical doodad. Oh, I can make. I made my first electrical doodad. That's always useful. Uh, now what do I need for that? It's two gold and one cut stone. There's a lot of places around here that I can mine up. And that will be very useful. I'm just going to cook this and eat it. Um, cook some seeds and eat them too. Lots of places here I can mine up, so that would be useful. And I, it's basically all I've got to work with. No food around here. I've run out of food already. How do I make a trap? Um, and now it's raining. Cut grass and sticks. This isn't good, boys and girls. This is not good at all. Okay, we're about to hit into day three. Uh, I haven't made it past day four. That's just horribly pathetic of me. Um... Thanks for protection from the Elements Tree. Yeah, I can protect myself from the excessive rain by staying underneath trees. Oi, don't you dare. I need some of this. I need it to fill my belly. Um, tall bird, you laid an egg yet? No. Okay, I got a little bit too close. Well, will you bugger off? I have bigger problems to deal with. Um, what's even worse is that if I do... If I do manage to get enough uh, bits and pieces to, like, the twigs that I need to, uh, what should we call it, to, um, make a spear. If I manage to find crud, um, I need, need more twigs. I need, that's it, that's how this world is gonna kill me, not with a bang, but with twig loss. Uh, okay, so the knights are gonna get, okay, I'm soggy, getting soggy, see, this is, this is how you, ooh, it's twig, 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 twig. Okay, so I can't make a spear right now, though I have the... I'm gonna pop up, I'm gonna make a spear. I know I kind of need rocks and stuff a bit more sometimes, but the spear... Like, the I, I, the gold is useful for making electrical doodads, which helps me make um... yeah, the alchemy engine, uh, which it, the alchemy engine, alchemy engine will be wonderful, but I kind of need a spear to defend myself. So let's... Ah, oh, hurrah. Now I can somewhat fight things. Um, I also would like to... Uh, make a pretty parasol... Stop uh, Stop wandering too close to there, me. Make a pretty parasol. And it'll protect you from the ele elements. So I need flowers. Which, um... Seeds. Uh, flowers, which are around here somewhere. Um, and I need more seeds. More twigs. And I need everything. Where where are these twigs? I need a twig heavy biome. <laughs> that's what I need. Biome? That's Minecraft. I still I still need it. Um Twig heavy biomes. I also need twigs for the er uh, for the for the pick so I can get some gold. It's gonna be raining excessively today, isn't it? I'm gonna get all damp. Um I need oh Oh, the uh, the pigs are now back to regular. Those were the things that attacked me just then. They are were pigs, saplings. I just just recognise them. I always look at them over, but they're were pigs, which means at night they turn into horrible monstrosities, just like me uh, when you don't give me coffee. But um, 
dint to horrible monstrosities and attempt to murder you for your flesh or other such reasons. I'm not quite sure. I never stayed around long enough to ask them. Well, when that one time I did stay around long enough to ask them, they attempted to, you know, eat me. So, um... Hello, pig. I hate you. So there's probably a pig village down here, which could be good... Okay, no, this is a graveyard. This isn't a pig village at all. This is a graveyard. So, not merms. Um... Well, yes, merms. Lots of merms. Uh, but no pig village. I was hoping for... Is there any room? I don't think I have any room. Um, plant some of these. Nowhere near me, unfortunately, but planting them is good. Get out my pickaxe. Pickaxe will be useful at a later date, I am sure. Pigs can remain up there. Withered old tree. Hello, grave. I don't want to be in the graveyard. Maybe this is why the uh, the pigs all turned into uh, big angry merms. Ooh, that's another rabbit uh, rabbit hole thing. Remember, I um, <laughs> yeah, I I got this up a few, well, a few moments ago, basically, like in the previous playthrough. I this is a rabbit hole, and rabbit holes. I'm still not quite comfortable going down into. Um, okay, I don't have enough rocks. Oh, the bitter irony. Ah, here we go. And I'm also hungry. I just, I need somewhere with food. Um, so, can I make an electrical doodad now? There? Oh, I need carved rocks. I need more rocks to rock the rock. Rock, 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 around the clock tonight. Um... Maybe I won't... Maybe this will be a, a sort of one of those ones that it's just I carry it around. Um, it was a rabbit hole. But uh, yeah, I, I just... I, I uh, don't stay in one place permanently. This is just one of those ones where I just pray that... No, oh, that these don't come in the night. Oh, God, they always find me. Something always finds me. Uh, food. Food is good. Food food to fill my belly. Um, okay, I will carry that around in my pack, like, in my hand. Uh, okay, no, 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 okay, I can't. I'm gonna have to, uh, pick flower, pick flower, pick... I'm going back on myself. I just realized I'm going back to where I was before. Um, because there was very little in that direction. Maybe this direction will hold better things. Uh, mushrooms over there. Mushrooms can quench your hunger, but they can also severely damage you. Um, I need a backpack as well, and there's more uh, more berries up here. Ah, oh dear. Yeah, they're gonna, gonna do two separate bases. Um, yeah, uh, let's, let's, let's use a base. I'm gonna do a basic campfire, because I am... Really, <laughs> really, uh, just trying not to die, and trying to conserve all my uh, things that I have. I still have, um, I still and still have the spears. I still have the uh, everything. I have lots of things. I have lots of things. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be. Fine. Okay, just remember that I have spears. I have a log coat. Log coat is wonderful. Um. I have an electrical doodad. Whirring with electricity. Do you really create electricity by just combining um, stuff like that? Uh, okay. I can put petals on the fire. And that will keep it going for a little bit. It's only a couple of hours. Hours till the day. Ooh, a sapling. And a flower. Wonderful. Um, a few hours till the day. A few hours till the day. Uh, oh, this will never last. Okay, I, I wonder if I can... No, it's it's not drying me off at all. Uh, cut, uh, thing is, that I don't want to waste resources, but I'm going to have to... If A little bit more fuel. Come on. The fire's getting a bit low. Exactly, yes, I understand you. I understand what you're going through, and I'm, I'm sorry, but we, <laughs> it's dangerous out here. Um, got twigs, many twigs. Science, electrical doodads, uh, needs more 
cut stone. I need more planks for that. And one more electrical doodad and I'm making a late an alchemy engine. An alchemy engine will help me survive a bit more because it'll allow me access to even better things. And even possibly what could happen is that it might allow me uh, to... Well, basically, when you dig up those graves, you get uh, some interesting things. Um... Petals? Just in case. You never want to be vulnerable in this game, as I've learnt over two deaths in... Two episodes? No, th yeah, this would be my third episode, I believe. So, two deaths, really quickly. This is the perfect bunny farm. Look at this, there's so many bunnies in the area. Um, and there's lots of grass, lots of twigs, carrots. I'm going to have to move a bit more over here, I'm afraid. Uh, there's even a wormhole, and wormholes are useful for transportation. Well, eat it then. Um, I eat the petals as well. But uh, wormholes are good for transportation. They will get you from A to B in perhaps a very disgusting manner. <laughs> but oh well, it's what you you deal for. You know, transportation. I'm pretty sure London Metro is more disgusting than this place, but uh, you get what you're given. You can't always get what you want. Okay, bees. Bees are a pretty good sign. A good, why? I don't know. I'm not actually sure why I said that. But, um, it's something. Actually, this has been recording has been going on for quite some time. We're into day four. I think I'm going to leave it here. Uh, in this point. And I... I really hope the next episode you don't see me embarrass myself again by dying horribly at the hands of, who knows, that tall bird might come and seek me out. Something that has a slight grudge on me, or something that decides that I'm looking at it's funny, or i am been looking at it's bird. Bored? Um, I, I'm going to try my best to survive, but as you can tell, in this game, your best can sometimes not be good enough. Sometimes your best is resulting in horrible monstrosities coming down upon you and deciding that your best can go insert itself inside its rectal cavity. So, um, yeah, I don't know where I went with that. We're going to leave it here before anything horrible happens. And I am going to do my darn best. Manure! I am going to do my darn best to survive, because that was a lucky find. Alright, I dropped my poop, everyone. Goodbye.